question four. Assume we have BL process instruction is located at address hex 06AA and the address of the subroutine process is 06B0. All right. What is the value of, piece of the PC after executing the BL process instruction? Right. So after executing this instruction, where is my PC? It's going to be pointing here, right? Or actually, no, it's going to be pointing, yeah, it's going to be pointing here. Right? Because what does the BL instruction do? Right, how? Right, so it adds, it adds the offset, right? And then it puts it into the PC. So I get, I'm going to branch to here. So my new PC is going to, let me move this up. <coughs> so the address of the PC is going to be 0, 0, 0, 4, 5, 6, B, 0. Okay? Does that make sense? Okay. What was pushed to the stack while executing the BL process instruction? Can anyone tell me? Anyone? Does anyone have any idea? Is the link register pushed to the stack? No, right? Because the link register is in the link register. The return address is not pushed to the stack. No, right? Because that's the PC you're going to return to is stored in the link register, right? So it doesn't get pushed to the stack. So I what? It's not the PC plus one. And I don't think it pushes the PSR when you go to a subroutine. Right? It's going to preserve that So what, the answer here is actually nothing. As far as I know. Right? That's one of those tricky questions where you got to be like real confident that you've read the entire book. Right? Or like that you've read at least as far as you're supposed to. Yeah. Well, I mean, when I call the function, right, the BL process instruction, when I read its definition on the data sheet, it never says it pushes anything, right? On the data sheet, it should. So if I use the BL, BL instruction, I should know if it pushes something. It doesn't, right? Because what is there to push, right? I could push the, the PSR, but I don't push the PSR. I only push PSRs, if you remember, from 306 on an interrupt, right? That doesn't happen here. So. I don't think there is a branch instruction that pushes on the stack. There might be one. I don't know. <coughs> but for the purpose of class, I don't think there's one. Yeah? So whenever it's popping, it's based on the instruction? Yes. Um, okay, so other than the PC, did executing the BL process instruction change any other register? The link register, which is register 14. 14. Okay, so the LR is the same right, as R14. What is register 13? Just while we're here. It's the stack pointer, right? What is the PC? 15. Do we have to know that? Pointers? Like for C? C pointers? Okay, he mean, what he means is there's no C pointers. So like in assembly, anytime I use anytime I use a load instruction, I'm using pointer. So there will be no C pointers on this test. But do you have to know the registers? Yes. This you should know, right? Because if someone if if they give you a tricky piece of code like this, and they're modifying R15, and you're like, oh, and it goes. So this is, this is what he, someone could do if they were really mean on the test. Right? <coughs> I could do, I could have some, some address here, right? 
of an instruction that does add R15 4, right? And then I have some instruction here, right? Like add R0, R0, 1. And then here, at my next, I have <coughs> add And say R0 is initially 0, right? What's going to happen here? Yeah, it's going to skip the second instruction. If I don't know that R15 is the PC, I can't answer this question. Do you know what I mean? I'll get it wrong, because I'll just go, oh, I don't know why they did this one. So it, you definitely need to know that, right? Yes? Yeah, the answer to part C is just going to be So we don't have variable size instructions for the purpose of this class. All our instructions are going to be 60 bits. Right? Would you say? Yeah, each memory location is 8 bits. So you're talking about little Indian or big Indian? So, for the purpose of this class, we assume that all instructions are 16 bits, right? So if I skip four memory locations, I'm going to skip four 8-bit locations. So, when I have memory, right, so unlike the LC3, each memory address is 32 bits, right? So this is some 32-bit address. This is only an 8-bit value, right? So I assume that all my... Actually, two... Yeah. Well, okay, so for the purpose of this, I don't know why he did it like this. I was asking about the example you wrote down about adding the secret Okay, so I'm assuming that, so in that example, I would be assuming that each instruction is 32 bits. But for the purpose of this class, right, he told you that each instruction is 8 bits, or 16 bits. Right, so the, for the purpose of this class, all instructions are 16 bits. I did 4 because, I don't know, I was thinking of something else. Okay, so if you're like at the top location, you add... If I had 4, then it would have skipped 2. So sorry, yeah. So you're right, I was wrong. Like, yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, so the reason the reason I said four is because I for whatever reason assumed they were thirty-two bits, because I was looking at this. But that's actually only What's the second half of C? What? What's the second half of C? If yes, no which register and what value So So if no, say none. If yes, I just specify which register. So the link register got so the link register got changed. And what did the link register get changed to? It got changed to hex zero blah 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 zero six eight nine four. Right. Okay. Yes. What? <coughs> It's saying, it's asking about the BL process instruction, not about the BL process <coughs> routine. Okay. Cool? Alright, yeah, sorry about the mix-up.